Maybe we should just call it a Ben's movie. How about Ben's filming life? Ben's filming the movie. Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Ben's filming the movie starring Benjamin Held. So just sit back, relax and enjoy the movie. To take one. Hi, my name is Benjamin Howard. I am 14 years old and my special interest is Back to the Future and I love filming and movies. He never really spoke until four years old. He would make lots of sounds and that sort of thing and he, he really never made a sentence or clear words until he was about four. What I like about acting is like um, staring at people and uh, keeping my head very still like and um, I like speaking like an American and uh, I like acting as a different person. I think sometimes the characters he looks at, he sort of wants to be like them, as in being normal, because he knows he's got autism, you know what I mean? He's different, so sometimes I think that's his escape to get into a character that he can feel like a normal person on the screen, like Clint Eastwood or, you know, Justin Bieber or whoever he's looking at, he's sort of putting himself in their shoes. Autism is like, um, like having autism, like talking a lot. The reason why I have autism, so I talk to myself. It's part of the brain that's not quite, like something's missing. It's, it's a perfect brain but there might be a, lot, a tiny little part that's not quite right, that's all it is. When he performs, it's like his autism just disappears. Do it! Just do it! Don't let your dreams be dreams. Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it! Make your dreams come true! Just do it! As soon as the monologue finished, he was Back to Ben Howard. Well, my teacher is Mr. Alex Rowe. He's been in two adverts, one episode and two TV shows, and in one movie. In House Husbands, he played Magnus that had a bandage around his head, and um, he played Nathan in 20-something that was a builder. And he played Jared that was a criminal, you know? He was a crook, being naughty. He's pretty much my personal IMDb. So he's pretty much an actor. The reason why I like him, because, because he's an actor, and he could be a teacher as well. <coughs> I'm fine, yeah. Now I'm an actor. We're both actors now. I'm a film actor. Well, sometimes men take matters into their own hands. Damn it, Colonel, just tell me the truth! You can't handle the truth! He often, though, plays characters like at home. Sometimes I don't notice. I just think he's just said something and I was like, well, that made sense. Yeah, good work, Ben. I'm like, oh, that's from a movie. <laughs> he plays all the characters in the whole film, so he knows everyone's lines, and he changes his voice to the character. Gosh. Perfectionist is the word. He can't stop until he gets it right. My favourite actor is Michael J. Fox, and he plays Marty McFly in Back to the Future. Michael J. Fox is, is short, and his height is one six three, so he's not really he's not really very tall, you know. He loves the movies, loves it, and he keeps repeating with the remote. Yeah, yeah, just wait, just wait, just wait. Oh, one more time, one more time, one more time. And he gets all anxious, you know. One more time, one more time. Okay, I so said, do it one more time. And he gets in front of the mirror, and you know, looks at himself, makes sure he's making the right face. Like, uh, facial expression and, and all that sort of thing. So he does, he gets right into it and takes it all so seriously. You talking to me? Are you talking to me? Who the hell do you think you're talking to? Well, I'm the only one here. <laughs> Go ahead. Make my day. I love acting with him because he's just got such an amazing imagination. He has such a great ability to put that into performance. The makeup um, helps, you know, to cover the freckles. I'm really excited. And Marty McFly is almost ready to do the film.
Now, what you're going to hear is, is going to sound really incredible. And you're the only man on earth who will believe it. I'm from the future. I can prove that I am from 1985. See this? My driver's license. As far as 1987. I see what you've done with the photo and everything. Well done. Huh? No, Doc. You, you know, I, I really am from the future. Uh, doc, Doc, listen, you gotta hear me out. Get out of here. Get out of work. No, listen. I, I know that you invented a time travel machine and you had a vision that you were drawing a TFC. Great Scott. How do you know about that? I told you I am from the goddamn future. Cut. Yes, we're done. Well, that's it, everybody. And thank you for watching. And well, that's the wrap. And... Good night, everyone. I love you all. I think it was directed by Jackson Gillel. <laughs> Gargle. Is he Gargle? Gallagher. Gallagher, of course. Gallagher. Directed by Jackson Gallagher. That's the rap. <laughs>